Here's an overview of our Syscom 5000 controller. This is the home page. Go into mold settings. Here's kind of an overview of the machine. Gives you uh, positions and, and timers while it's live, running live in cycle. Go to the monitor value, just same information, just a little different layout. I'm going to go to cycle. This is going to build like a bar chart so you can optimize the cycle. It shows you where every individual item ends and the next one begins. And you can do power. It shows you how easy you're using the machine. Load on individual servo drives. Down here you can run a power consumption report. Uh, it also gives you some pointers on how to reduce power consumption even further. Back to the home page. This is our I.O. customization page. This is where you can program in and build your own recipes similar to a mold setup, only this is interlocking for inputs and outputs. You could use uh, this quite easily for doing vision system cameras or, or any device of your choosing. We'll go to J-Assist. For some of the newer guys that, that aren't uh, quite seasoned and troubleshooting of the molded part, it's kind of a flow chart. Depending on what kind of a defect you're seeing, we give you a complete flow chart of what to check and order of importance. We can go into the maintenance page. A lot of information here. You can do testing of several different items on the machine for inspection purposes. It also has the entire book on the machine. Um, so it's going to give you predictive maintenance, monthly, quarterly, semi-annual, annual, all the items that should be normally checked on the machine. And then finally, down here, in, in relationship to the touch screen, we, have, we still have uh, full functional buttons on the machine. So we have a combination of selector switches and push buttons.